Hi and welcome to the channel. Richard here. So I'm just at home doing some little updates and today as you can see by my pinion gear I've found a Traxxas 34 tooth pinion and thought I'd give it a try and obviously I've updated my spur gear which is a bit difficult to see under there but I've put in the Inter-G 38T spur gear so obviously so that the 34 pinion will fit I'm also trying a few little other ratios just to do some speed runs so this is the 29 tooth um, pinion gear this is a techno RC um, pinion this is the model number it's a mod 1 29 tooth and obviously when you're replacing the spur gear sometimes you do end up ripping the gasket so just to make sure I bought a set of gaskets so when I'm doing anything on the car just in case any mistakes I can change that over now this which is the 22 tooth mod one pinion I achieved 128 kilometers an hour with this with the stock more or less everything stock except for um, I changed the tires and basically tried out some tires um, online um, I don't know if you can see these clearly, but these have not been too bad. I taped them up um, before I glued them and they don't balloon that much. Unfortunately, these tires that I purchased as well seemed very good, but as you'll see right here on my first run, they failed so not a great result with those so in light of that just arrived today is my new GRP tires so I'm hoping that the speed runs will take off to a new level um, quite impressed with these guys they sent me some tyre mounts included set of um, decals, some stickers and also a t-shirt so hey pretty impressed with those guys um, so I'm hoping speed runs obviously I've, the fans will, will need to really be on all through the speed runs because they the ESC is going to obviously get a bit warm and I'll upgrade some of the bearings to sealed bearings and I'll be running success see what I can do soon um, maybe I'll put on the GRPs so you can see what it looks like so basically that's the tyre, the tread, I've gone with the whites, they've got a hole there to stop any of the build up of air supposedly but they come pre-glued and they're pretty solid. So on the car
and look pretty cool. So we'll see what we can do with these. I won't bother screw them up now, but that's how they look. So that should actually really help the performance of the car when I do my next speed run. So for now that's it. Hope you enjoyed the video. Please comment, share, whatever, and I'll be uploading a speed run soon just to see how the new setup works and how these tires hold out. Okay, Richard signing off and enjoy your day. Okay.